and now we continue with our blind ride for the rest of the trail really tight switchback which I just messed up straight across these rocks there well. So I just stopped because of this massive drop-off that we have here in the middle of the trail. And just to give you a perspective, this is even more than knee high. So this is the big drop-off from below. And there's one problem if you would want it to send it. I guess would be that you might either land just with your front tire close to this rock which could send you over the bar or you might even hit your back wheel on this rock here which is quite sharp so this could be a rim bender but there's not much option to go on here okay so once again this drop going up high here slow down and we continue on so here we have another tight switchback where i should have taken the inside line there Take care to not hit your bars on that rock there. seems that the trail is flattening out a bit and it has some flowy parts in between some chunkier sections hop over this squeeze through there So, and this is the star gate of the Queen stage, the shortened Queen stage of Sunday's race. So as you can see there are some pretty tough tire marks, but it's dried up pretty good. The riders went up and over this rock here which is not what I fancy doing oh, deep rot there oh, so this is really junky to this flatter section. Whoa. So, as you could see there, I had to hop over all these kind of water gates 
And I did pick up too much speed in between. I almost couldn't make the corner down below. Now, this is much flowier. You can see the rut is where probably most riders decided to straight line through all of this wow have to be really precise with those water gates or flop gates whatever they're called since you could really bend your rims so I came into this section a little bit too fast before and couldn't quite slow down enough and almost got thrown over the bar here so I want to make sure to go slow enough there oh, ugly pole sticking out here as well really steep drops and around this tight corner and an insane switchback corner who had to hit the eject button here okay so going to reattempt this really technical switchback and failed once again I have to put a foot down there here as well Rods are pretty nasty since they are really dry and once your front wheel gets caught in one of them it's almost impossible to get out again to creep in real slow here and didn't even manage to get around the corner there this stuff is really technical Exhausted. So to be honest, this previous section with these steep chunky parts and these tight switchbacks in between was quite 
outside of my comfort zone. Whoa, almost slid out on the front tire. Switchbacks. Oh, got caught in this deep rut there. 